up, everybody? It's the homie Truth Teller, the street reporter. And you seen Mama Duck. She went off today. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't like seeing Mama Duck like that, you know? I think Mama Duck got a gentle mental, in my opinion. So when I seen that, you know, it kind of rubbed me the wrong way. I'm not gonna lie. You know, at the end of the day, I think that's some family shit. And I think, unfortunately, a lot of their family is known on the internet. So the internet seen that. So everybody get to put their own words to it. Videos get to get uploaded and people put their own captions to it and shit like that. So we see that. Um, I don't think people understand, you know, this is a touchy situation. Her son died now. You know, FBG Duck had the clout. It's a lot of people we wouldn't even know if it weren't for Duck. So I guess she might feel like it's not enough dues being paid, you know. It's not enough respect being handed out. Ain't enough looking out, you know. It's a lot of labels and street record labels and street names that's coming up and coming out of that camp when Duck was really the main person of this shit, you know. And I guess she kind of feel like people ain't reaching back like they supposed to reach back. That's understandable. That's a mom, you know. Situations get touchy like that. You know, the whole thing with Flame, I get it. When I listen to the shit, when she speak on Flame, she speak on the family, she speak on the brothers, the sisters. This seemed like some personal shit, you know, that just so happily got on the internet. You know, Mama Duck got a lot of clout. Everybody know Mama Duck. So, you know, when she speak, the internet tends to get up on it. I can say, in my opinion, though, you know, we got to just be careful uh, when we get real emotional and get on the internet. Because, you know, the fans love making their own captions and making shit bigger than it is. Because over, you know, in, in, in less than 15 minutes after that live was uploaded, um... 15 minutes later, it made it look like it was an issue between Mama Duck and Ruga, you know? And that might be some personal shit. That's some family shit. That's not no real, real beef shit. So when I see shit like that, I can e easily in my mind say, yeah, this is some family shit that just got on the internet. But I do feel her pain. I feel her struggle, you know? You see Ruga doing his thing. He blowing up. You see a lot of people doing their thing blowing up. So I clearly see what's going on. So, I mean, you can't really get mad at it, you know? So... She kind of feel like, you know, it got to be some better reach, you know. Guys doing a lot, you know. It's a lot of money being uploaded in these Instagram pictures. You know, it's a lot of videos, people showing them bands and them racks and them cars and them houses. Reach back to Big Mama. Reach back to Mama Duck. You know, reach back to BCR Records. Why is it a competition thing, you know? I guess that's how she feel about it. Everybody supposed to be in on this shit to make sure Big Cloud Records blow up. That's what FBG Duck wanted. And she probably feel like it's a lot of people out for self right now, you know, and, you know, I'm not saying she right, I'm not saying she wrong, you know, don't get me wrong, I know it's Mama Duck, I know it's Mama Duck, it's Duck Mama, but, you know, we all can be wrong sometimes, but, at the end of the day, I don't really got a personal opinion on that, I think that's family, subscribe to my YouTube channel, it's the homie truth teller,